Man, a bass player to me is kind of like the glue, you know. Um, we're, we're those guys that nobody ever knows, or guys and gals, I should say, that nobody ever really knows about. Everybody thinks we're guitar players. <laughs> but you'll definitely know when we're not there. Bass came in because at the time my dad uh, and I were musicians at the church. The bass player of the church uh, went, moved on to another church. And um, like in every church situation, there's always a thousand drummers um, and never enough bass players. So literally, the bass was sitting there one Sunday and I picked it up. So Christine, uh, she is, she knows her music, you know, um, like any artist should. Um, and her favorite instrument is the bass. We'll, you know, we'll be playing something right there on the stage. She'll turn around, give me a look, and then we'll talk about it afterwards. We'll laugh and then we'll talk about it afterwards. So this is, uh, a really interesting combination of woods, which I mentioned earlier, I'd never tried before. Um, this is alder and maple. Um, I was always more, I guess if you want to call a traditionalist or something where I, it was either alder rosewood or ash maple kind of thing. But this opened up my ears to a really, really interesting, uh, uh, I guess, tonal palette because you do get the warmth and you do get the full body um, from that alder. Um, but you still get the, the articulation and the clarity and all that from the, from the maple. Um, combine that with the electronics, which is the, the Federa preamp, and these really, really cool pickups that, that uh, Aguilar just released, and you just get this tone, man, that uh, I, the best way I could describe it, it's just present, it's strong. When you plug in, you're like, boom, I'm here. Even with the strings going a little dead on me recently, the bass still sounded great. You know, there was no, it wasn't muddy, it wasn't dark, it was perfect. I tried to approach things, honestly, like um, somebody like Ricky Minor, somebody like Nathan East, that they're literally able to play any style of music and they do it effectively, you know? That's what keeps them working, that's what keeps them, you know, in the scene. I mean, anybody will call them to record, to play Latin, to play, you know, Broadway, to play jazz, to play whatever, and they do it exceptionally well. We're the guys that, you know, the group of people that just hold it all together. Um, but that doesn't mean that that's all we do, but I feel like, you know, that's kind of like our, our thing. Like, you know, we, we hold it down, we keep it together, we make it feel good. We feel that low area, you know, work with the drummer to make sure everything's feeling good, feeling right, and uh, just making things sound good. You know? I think if there's no bass, you don't have a bass. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. But really, 